Hi everybody, welcome back. Do you know in today's video I show you things that I buy pretty cheaply at thrift stores and that sell pretty fast online. So that should be a lot of fun, huh? And pretty informative. So what are we waiting for? Let's get thrifty. As soon as I got into this store, I walked right over to see what the color of the week was. And it was blue. That means anything with a price tag on it that's blue is 50% off for the whole week. I started thrifting over on their toy aisle where I saw this plush doll. Well, it turned out that it was a character from South Park. His name is Kyle. They were asking $4.99 for him. And online, it goes for around $25. Nice markup. So I had my first item. A few hours later, I saw this easy seat bicycle replacement seat. Well, it had a blue sticker. They were asking $7.99 for it. So since it was half price and it sells for $35 online, I definitely put this in the cart. When I got to this row, I noticed right up ahead of me this golf ball sweet spot finder. Another blue sticker. It was only $4.99, so that's half price. And online, these go for about $25. This is getting fun. I came over to their wall of bags. This is where they keep all their loose stuff that they don't know what to do with. And usually there's just junk in these bags. And today was no exception, so I kept walking. I walked to the back of their store where I saw this set of 10 Green Bay Packer string lights. They were asking $9.99 for them. No, no blue sticker. But still, they go for 30 online. So definitely, they're mine. Well, store number one is done. There's no place left to look. So, unless I just want to keep walking around in circles, I guess it's time to head to the next store. Okay, I'll meet you guys out in the car. Well, guys, it's almost time to be heading to the second store today. But I want to talk to the non-subscribers. You know, if you're a non-subscriber to my channel, you're going to have to walk or Uber to the next store because the front seat and the back seat's getting full with subscribers, and they get first preference. Now, I do want to warn the non-subscribers. There's some scary things happening out there. Yeah, some scary things. So, if I were you, I'd probably hit the subscribe button. But, that's up to you. You know, but for now, we gotta get heading to that second store. Okay, I'll see you there. I hope you rethink this. When I got to this store, I walked right over to their Halloween section, where I saw this Tri-Wizard Harry Potter goblet. They were asking three ninety nine for it. It lit up, and online... These are going for between 20 and $25. So I had my first item here. As I got closer to this aisle, I noticed this wall-hanging medallion of the Heidelberg Castle in Germany. They were asking $2.99 for it, and online, they go for around $20. I had never seen these before, but they're selling. I took a walk over to their toy aisle, and I'm glad I did, because I saw this Pirates of the Caribbean Jack Sparrow figure. They were asking $6.99 for it, and this particular figure goes for around $35 online. Yeah, that's a pretty good find. This aisle started out pretty interesting, but there was nothing here for me. You know, sometimes you look and you look, and there's just nothing. So I headed around the corner to the next aisle. This was the last aisle I was going to search at this store, and I ran across this plush doll. Her name was Misa the Inquisitor Master. They wanted $4.99 for her, and online she goes for around $25. Well, guys, it's time to be heading to the third store today. But before we go, I just want to tell you that if you see anything in any of my videos that you're interested in, just click the eBay link below. You'll be taken to my store, 
and have a look around. Maybe you'll find something you like. And if not, that's okay, too. Okay, but for now, let's get into that third store. Well, it didn't take me long to find my first item at this store. This was only the second aisle I walked down. I saw this Rosa Care hair removal device. They wanted five ninety eight for it. And online, they go for between 30 and $35. Not bad. This store has a nice little section of ceramics, so I definitely wanted to take a look at it. I saw this mother and daughter figure. It said Holly Hobby on the bottom. They were asking $4.98 for it. It was made in 1978, and they go for about $25 online. I continued down that ceramic aisle, hoping to find some more stuff. Well, I did. I came across this woman's credit card and bill holder. They were asking two ninety eight for it. And when I looked them up online, they go for around $20. This next row wasn't very exciting at all. But that didn't bother me because there was still plenty of store to see. This is a pretty big Goodwill. On this next row, I ended up buying something I usually wouldn't buy. It was a mouse pad. Now, they don't go for that much money. But this was Marvin the Martian, who I really liked when I was young. And it was only $1.98, so I bought it for me. I wasn't finding anything on this aisle, and then as I got towards the end of it, I saw this monkey holding a leaf. Well, it turned out that it was a trinket tray. They wanted $3.98 for it, and it's also an incense burner, and online, they go for $25. In their back room, I saw this knee walker. It's for people who had an operation on their leg. They wanted $14.98 for it. It was called Oasis Space, and online, these go for like $75 used. Yeah, I took this. Okay, guys, well, that's it for store number three. Now all I have to do is take this knee walker and load it into my car, and then go to lunch. If you want to come, you're more than welcome. Follow me. Okay, guys, well, that's it. There is no more. But I do want to tell you one thing. Next week, I have another What Sold update video coming out. So I don't want you to miss that. But until then, stay safe out there, guys. Stay safe. Bye-bye.